What are differences between dog and a wolf? Is it true that dogs are descendants of wolves? Is it possible to crossbreed them? And is it possible to have wolf as home pet? You will find answers to all these questions in this video. Hi, it's Rajin from Rockadog. We all know that dogs and wolves are closely related together, but when you look at some breeds like Chihuahua or Boston Terrier, it's hard to believe that they are that similar. Chaka Ture probably noticed this too and he requested video about differences between dogs and wolves. First, let's say that it's not true that dogs are descendants of wolves. They share the same ancestor, which is now extinct. At, la at least, that's what scientists are saying. But we hear everywhere that dogs and wolves are very similar, especially in marketing campaigns of food companies and dog trainers. The first big difference is in their appearance, but it's hard to talk about their differences in appearance since there are more than 300 very different dog breeds. You can watch my video about all of them, links in description. But we can compare wolves to dogs like Siberian Husky, Alaskan Malamus, Czechoslovakian Wolf Dog. It's dog breeds that are very similar to wolf. If we compare those, we will see that dogs are smaller than wolves. Wolves have larger heads, paws and legs, but they have narrow chest and hips, which dogs tend to have wider. Both dogs and wolves have the same amount of teeth, which is 42, but wolves' jaws are much bigger and definitely much, much stronger. Another appearance difference is in their eye color. The most common color of dogs' eyes is brown, while wolves' eyes are never brown. They have most of the time amber eyes. Let's talk about personality and behavior. Dogs are happiest if they can live with us, with people, while wolves are happiest and healthiest if they can live in wilderness. Wolves are much more independent and they don't like strangers and definitely not human strangers, but they are loyal to their pack just like most of the dogs are loyal to their family. The domestication of dogs was a long process and it's, it's important to say that dogs are not just domesticated wolves. The domestication not only changed them in appearance, it has greatly influenced their emotional development as well. Uh, I don't know how to explain this, but you might heard or you might see, saw some people rescue wolf that is now living with them. It's true that wolf can live with you in some fenced area. You might even train him some tricks uh, just a little bit, but you will never domesticate him. He will always be a wild animal. We can definitely say that dogs are more social animals. You can house train them, they can live with other animals, even from different species. But we can probably say that wolves are more intelligent, at least in general. They are much more aware of their environment as compared to dogs. Wolves are howling much often than average dog. They also like to dig holes. They dig holes much more often than dogs as well. It's their way to cool them down during summer and they use it when they are looking for food as well. And what do they like to eat? Wolves are carnivores, which means that they just need flesh, especially mooses and deers. It's true that they can eat forest berries and other stuff, but main source of their food must be meat. On the other hand, dogs can eat almost anything. It's because of evolution. They are able to live on milk products, bread, oatmeal and other stuff. I'm not saying it's healthy for them, but they are omnivores and they would eat almost anything. As I said, it's impossible to domesticate wolf, but it's also very hard to domesticate wolf dog. 
Wolf dog is mixed between dog and wild wolf. There are many people that have wolf dog, but it's still very hard to domesticate this kind of animal. You just cannot own wolf or wolf dog, they are too independent for that. Tell me in comments if you would love to get in touch with wolf or wolf dog. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, subscribe to this channel and turn the notifications on to see every new video. Also check our Instagram and Facebook. Links are in description. See you in the next video.